Okay. Let's save first. And let's continue. Let's get the Shadow Broker, Liara. Shepard, it's good to see you again. Hey, babe. So, what can I do for you? I know you're looking for the Shadow Broker. Cerberus gave me data on where to find him. Interested? Absolutely. I had no idea. Let me see what you've got. It looks like a leaked transmission between Shadow Broker operatives. Some hints as to the location and... It's about Farron. He's still alive. Who's Farron? He was a friend. He helped me recover your body from the Shadow Broker. What? Why did the Shadow Broker want my corpse? He was going to sell you to the Collectors, but Farron and I stopped him. Farron sacrificed himself to save me. So you rescued me. Then how did I end up with Cerberus? Well, they gave me intel to help recover you. They actually put Farron with me in the first place. After I got out, I gave you to them. They said they could bring you back. Oh, okay. So, you're the one responsible for me ending up with Cerberus? Why? Was I supposed to let my friend die when someone offered a sliver of hope? They brought you back, and now they're giving me a chance to find Farron. After two years, I hadn't even dreamed. Is that my tech? Sounds like you and Farron were close. It's funny. He betrayed me more than once. He was double dealing for Cerberus, for the Shadow Broker. But in the end, he sacrificed himself for me. I owe him. If he's been the Shadow Broker's prisoner for two years, he may not be in good shape. I know. But yesterday, all I wanted was the chance to avenge his death. Today, he's alive. I'll do whatever I have to do to get him back. Okay, Liara. Any friend me, of yours? Let is me a return the favor. What's the next step? I, I don't know. I need to prepare to think. I'm going home. Use my terminal if you need any local intel. You okay? I've spent two years plotting revenge. Now I have the chance to make it a rescue. Let me help. I'll come by your apartment. Okay. Hopefully, I'll have a plan by then. Thank you, Shepard. You're welcome, babe. Ready <sighs> in just minutes difficult, but one man, Conrad Werner, wants to help. Werner is organizing Shepherds, a charity that helps human refugees, orphans, and former war prisoners. In a prepared statement, he said that this new charity is his way of showing his support for the people who protect the galaxy. Oh, this like our man Conrad Werner fi finally did something right wait there's something about this yeah where is she might be her yep. pardon me i'm dealing with damn ilium travel bureaucracy were you trying to get them to help you find this locket oh steven thank you thank you so much my daughter was young when he died this is the only memento she has of him Please accept this. It's much less than I would have had to pay the bureaucrats to authorize a search. She is grieving. Oh. There we go. Run away, you bastards. Damn, this Volus is, is a bastard. And that's why I hate Volus. First that Volus ambassador in ME1. And then that other guy that arguing with Shorban, and that's that. That pity four. What's next? <laughs> you can sell something that didn't. I'm going to say it. Gateway weapons and armor are good enough for Eclipse. I hate bullets. Screw them. Loyal. Mm, that's better. Seal off those trace samples and get them back to the lab. We got multiple shots fired. Yeah, techs are going over the place now. Wait, what happened? Central, we got an open carrier on this end. Switching to a coded relay. What's going on? Hmm. 
Who is she? This area is sealed off. Please step back, sir. Sealed off? Why? Someone tried to kill your friend, Commander Shepard. Thank you, officer. Your people are dismissed. So where is she? You can't do that. Already done. Who are you? Till I was here. Tila Vasir, Special Tactics and Recon. Spectre? A Spectre? I heard your status was reinstated. Good. You're one of our most famous operatives. Might even get you to sign my chest plate. <laughs> so, I assume you had business with your friend this evening, Commander. Liara was following a lead on the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? Dangerous enemy to have. What are the facts so far? About 25 minutes ago, someone took a shot at Tissoni. Note the bullet holes. She stuck around for almost four minutes before leaving the building. Whatever she was so, doing was important. So she's escaped. If Liara isn't here, where is she? If I knew that, I wouldn't be sifting through her crap. There's no blood, no body. It looks like Tissoni got away. The sniper didn't plan on her kinetic barrier. Clever girl. Paranoid, but clever. How did you know that? Did the police find anything when they arrived? Just the mess and the bullet holes. I gave them a gold star for finding the bullet holes. Hmm. You sound suspicious. Liara was expecting me. She would have left a message here. Her office wasn't safe. I'm not surprised. Ilium is just Omega with expensive shoes. I haven't found anything useful for tracking her down yet. You knew Tassoni better than I do. Where would she have hidden her backups? Let me take a look around. Okay, I did not trust her. Yeah, that's not the Asari homeworld. I'm not sure what planet that is. It's Ilos. Ah, oh, yep, it's Ilos. That trench on the final mission. Normandy. The picture changed when you touched it. It must be keyed to your ID. What does it show now? It's a Prothean dig site. Liara did leave a message. There are a few Prothean looking objects around the apartment. Let's see what we can find. This is some nice apartment. Damn, Liara. She was certainly into ugly. <laughs> Vasir, I've got something here. Backup disk. Let's try it on her terminal. It looks like she recorded a call. What have you got for me, Sigat? It was tricky, but you paid for the best. I can narrow it down to a cluster, maybe even a system. How soon can you have it? Shouldn't take long. Come to my office. Barrier Frontiers in the Dracon Trade Center. Gotta say, though, to Sony, you're making me a little nervous. How big is the trouble that could come out of this? Relax, Sikat. I'll see you in a few hours. Sounds like Liara found something big on the Shadow Broker. And then someone found her. I know where the Dracon Trade Center is. My car's outside. Let's go. Area Frontier's offices are located on the third floor. I don't hear police chatter. We must have missed the party. Damn, that's loud. Liara's Shit. in there. Oh god. By the goddess. They just took out three floors to make sure she's dead. I'll grab this guy car and seal off the building from the top. I'll start down here and work my way up. Just leave some for me. We are committed to providing so many dead bodies, damn.
I'm gonna put you in the first one. Nasir, I've pinned down. Work. And they're well armed. Stay alone with the Shadow Rovers Private Army Commander. They're your frontiers. <laughs> Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> Enemy drone. Yara, where are you? Oh shit! Oh, that back. Oh, that's cool. Oh shit! Is that the cat? Been a few seconds faster, I could have stopped them. Is this a cat? Must have been. No sign of that data Liara talked about. Looks like a dead end. Oh, speaking of which, did you find your friend's body? You mean this body? Hey, Liara. Liara. Something I should know. This is the woman who tried to kill me. I knew it. You I knew it from the start. Yourself. I knew I'll it. That slide. Why don't you put that gun down? I saw you. I doubled back after I left. I watched you break into my apartment. And she used me. Fucking hell. So what? You were just using me to find the message? Nothing personal, Shepard. Just needed a little help tracking down Liara. Fuck off. Once she had my location, she signaled the Shadow Broker's forces. They bombed the building to take me out. She found Sakat, took his data, and killed him. I'm guessing she's still got the disc on her. Good guess. Not that you'll ever see what's on it. You pure blood pet! Come on, let's kill her! Let's kill this bitch! You go, go. All right, we need to go. We need to go. Okay, 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 I'm coming, I'm coming. Mm. I'm fine, by the way. Thanks for asking. <laughs> 
I never thought we could use car in this. She's oh. around the corner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not going into the construction site, are? Huh? Oh, goddess. Come on. Let's go, Gare. I'm not letting her escape with that data. Yes, I know. I know, Liara. I'm going. I'm going. Go, 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 go. I'm going. Uh, uh. Traffic. Oncoming traffic. We'll be fine. Come on. She's got reinforcements. What kind of guns does this thing have? It's a oh. taxi. It has a fare meter. Wonderful. <laughs> Truck. I know. Truck. I know. <sighs> there we go. You're enjoying this. Yes, I am. Come on, Shepard. Yeah, I hear those can be bad for you. You hear? What? Truck. Again? Okay. Shit. Come on, hit her. Hit her. Hit her, Ben. Well done. Well done. Let's kill her. Let's kill her. <laughs> I've crashed on Azure. Get me some damn backup. Well, at least, at least she's injured. Alright. Let's take care of her. Watch out! They're dropping reinforcements. There's Vizier's car. Come on, she can't have gotten far. Watch out! There's Vizier's car. Come on, she can't have gotten far. It blocked the door. <coughs> Enjoy the ride. Yeah, need that. I need that as well. No, I'm not in good health. Switch up. Get the arrow. Use it. Oh! Oh! What? What's for video? What? What kind of hotel is this? Azure. It's a luxury resort with an exotic edge. Azure is slang for a part of the Asari body in some areas of Ilium. Uh -huh. Where? Mainly the lower reaches, near the bottom. I meant where on the Asari body. So did I. Good one, the other good one. You don't want to share that one with me, yeah. Good call, the other. Good call. So what? She just kill it. Everyone? Everything. Shit. We will kill this bitch for sure. You die. You will die now, Sir. Vizier, it's over. Hey, hey, you. Come here. What's your name? Mariana. Mariana, you want to live, don't you? Tell those people that you want to live. Please. Hiding behind a hostage, huh? Even if you get out of here, you'll lose your Spectre status. You attack the Trade Center. You think so? I think maybe Cerberus Terrorist did that. Which story do you think the Council will believe? 
all you had to do was walk away. Now it gets ugly. Please, I have a son. A son? I hope he gets to see you again. I've heard losing a parent is just horrific for children. Oh, Scars screw this life. bitch. I'm going to end you, Fazir. It's okay, Liara. We'll handle it. The usual way. You want Mariana's little boy to grow up without a mommy, Shepard? Thermocliffs on the ground now. Power cells too. They are gonna give Brent a kit on this bitch. Hiding behind a hostage, Fazir? No stomach for a real fight. Just like an Asari. <laughs> Drop the thermocliffs, Shepard. You girls should really just stick to dancing. You know, play to your strengths. Drop the clips. I'm gonna kill your hostage, Vizier. And then I'm gonna show you how a real Spectre gets things done. Uh-oh. You're bluffing. Now, Liara. <laughs> Enemy combat drone. Miss me? Come on. How it? On our right. I'll finish you myself. Roll down. Come on. Come on, bitch. You die, man. Die. Oh, damn it. Damn it. Sakat's personal data pad. This has what we need to find the Shadow Broker. You're dead. The Shadow Broker has been in power for decades. He's stronger than anything you've ever faced. Is that why you sold out the Council to work for him? You think I betrayed the Council? Like Saren? Go to hell. The Broker's given me damn good intel over the years. Intel that saved lives and kept the Citadel safe. So if the Broker needs a few people to disappear, I'll pay that price without hesitation. Tell yourself whatever you like. The Council would never accept you working for the Shadow Broker. The Council? You pay them lip service while working for terrorists? You have any idea what Cerberus has done? Yes. I know who they are and what they've done. It doesn't matter. I think it does. You want to judge me? Look in the mirror. Kidnapping kids for biotic death camps? Killing Alliance admirals who ask questions? And you're with them? Don't you dare judge me. Oh. Don't you? Finally. Eliminate the Sony and retrieve the data. Civilian casualties not a concern. 
Basir's dead. I'm putting the data through to the Normandy's computers. We can be at the Shadow Broker's base in a few hours. Okay. He'll know about Vizier before long. If he decides to keep... We'll get Farron out of there alive, Liara. I promise. I know. You're here to help. Just like always. That's not a good thing? When we first met on Therum, you saved me from the Geth. You fought a Krogan Battlemaster while I cowered. Now you're doing it again. And I'm still leaning on you for help. That's what friends do, Liara. I can get us there based on Sakat's data. The Normandy's stealth drive will keep them from detecting us. The Shadowbroker's agents are still shooting their way through Ilium. With luck, they won't notice we've left until it's too late. That's a little cold. They killed innocent people. You know what I mean. Do I? When I hit the ground back at the Trade Center, you went after Vizier without a backward look. A little fall wasn't going to kill you. I had to stay on Vizier. I had to stay rational, make the call, like I did with Sakat. That's Vizier's fault, not yours. Sakat had no idea what the stakes were. I put him in harm's way to get the data I needed. I got him killed. And I'd do it again. But from here on out, things will be simple. Get in, get Farron, get out. And kill anyone who tries to stop us. That's it? That's it. Will you just stop for a second? We'll be jumping several light years. There's time to talk. About what? You haven't been the same since I came back, Liara. Yeah. What do you want me to say, Shepard? That I mourned you? That I feel guilty because Farron got captured? I made mistakes. I lost people. I helped get you back. And I want to do the same for Farron. I'll sit and talk once he's safe. Until then, enjoying the scenery is an insult to the man who saved both of us. Okay. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> Sorry, Liara. You just... You just obsessed. That's, that's why. lives in this? His ship follows the sunset, completely undetectable in the storm, unless you know where to look. How do we get inside? The shuttle bay is locked down. We'll need to land on the ship and hunt for a hatch. Okay. This is a long ass mission. <laughs> There's a constant lightning storm where the hot and cold air collide. from a communications array near the back of the ship. Okay. There's nothing below but maintenance equipment. We have to find an entrance near the back shielding. Well. That's a nasty storm, but well, at least the view is nice. Oh shit, the view. Careful. Those capacitors discharge built up lightning. Thanks for the tip. Shepard, try firing at the capacitors. <laughs> That's convenient. Oh. oh! Don't hit me! Don't hit me! I missed that. I have your back. You got it. Oh, come on. Oh, 
Okay, this ship is big and we're just walking around. Oh shit. Okay, looking down was clearly a mistake. Really? Didn't see anything down there. Come on guys. This ship is incredible. It must have taken decades to build in secret. I wonder what happened to the contractors. <laughs> I think we can guess. Okay. Is this the engine? What? Navigating the storm is brutal. If the ship's engines stop, even for a moment, at least the shadow broker would go down with us. Oh. That's comforting. <laughs> Motion damage. We're not we're not even halfway there. This this ship is huge. So steep. If this real, I probably just slip up or fly away. Anyone else want some? Oh shit! One less to worry about. Scratch one. Good job, Garrus. Good job. Okay, where to now? This lightning rod is on a rail. Do you see a switch? There. I see it. I see it. Not even a guardrail. I bet the broker's <laughs> agents love patrolling the hall. <laughs> At least the view is nice. Yeah, like I said. It's locked. Hang on, I've got a bypass shunt program that can crack it. How long will it take? I don't know, Shepard. I've never broken into the Shadow Broker's base before. Well, not this one anyway. <laughs> Firing a high impact shot. Right. You sure that shunt is working? It's illegal even on Ilium. It didn't come with a warranty. But you tested it, right? Here come more of them. Tell me you tested it. No touch gone. Okay, this is a bit chaotic. Remember the old days when you could just slap Omni Gel on everything? That security upgrade made a lot of people unhappy. Look out, more on the way. <laughs> Enemy oh. Woo! Goodbye, sucker. Please don't give the Mercs ideas. <laughs> Looks like a big one. Come on, Yara. Give him tactical advice. But now there'll be fewer left to deal with inside. Keep dreaming, Sony. <laughs> They're under control. It's me, Shepard. <laughs> Impressive. Go and drop. Understood. Oh, that's a bit chaotic. Right. Almost 3 a.m. We better make this quick. The 
hell is that sound? Oh, fuck off. Fuck off. This should slow him down. Come on. Nice shooting. Hmm. <sighs> Farron. Farron. Liara? Hold on. We're getting you out of here. No. Ah! Farron. I thought this looked too easy. This chair plugs into the broker's info network. You have to shut off the power. Pull me out now and my brain cooks. Do you know where we can cut the power? It won't be easy. You'll have to go to Central Operations. If he left you alive for us to find, the Broker has no idea how dangerous we are. Don't underestimate him. He prepares for everything. Central Operations is down the hall. You know the Shadow Broker's waiting for you, right? I'm counting on it. We'll be back for you, Farron. I'll try not to go anywhere. I want all teams to help us see. Uh oh. Get an LOS. Paint the marks. Enemy! Oh. Enemy by on the field. Nice shot. This should punch through their armor. Where the hell are you going? <laughs> Let's go find out what's this shutter breaker is. Okay, let's do it. What the hell is that? You're for the drone. Oh. Reckless. Even for you, Commander. That bombing on Ilium wasn't exactly subtle. Extreme, but necessary. No, it wasn't. Neither was caging Farron for two years. Dr. Tassoni, your interference caused all this. Farron betrayed me when he handed you Shepard's body. The Drell is simply paying the price. Someone was bound to come after you for working with the Collectors. It was a mutually beneficial partnership. Your arrival is convenient. The Collector's offer still stands. It'll be You're pretty done. hard to run a base this size with no crew. They're replaceable. Your arrival is barely an interruption. Enough talk. My operations are too crucial to be compromised by a traitor. Screw You're you. Quite confident for someone with nowhere left to hide. You travel with fascinating companions, Doctor. It's good you brought Archangel to Sony. Your friend's bounty is still unclaimed. You're not putting a hand on anyone. It's pointless to challenge me, Asari. I know your every secret while you fumble in the dark. Is that right? You're a Yogg, a pre-space flight Yogg. species quarantined to their homeworld from massacring the Council's first contact teams. Oh. This base is older Shit. than your planet's discovery. Which probably means you killed the original Shadow Broker 60 years ago, mm. then took over. I'm guessing you were taken from your world by a trophy hunter who wanted a slave. Or a pet. Damn. How am I doing? What the hell is it doing, Lyra? Oh, he's a big guy. Oh shit, Garrus! Ah, oh, damn it, Lyra! Come on, what the hell is this? Great. 
The shields can uh. be sensitive. Energy and projectiles are bouncing off. Then we do this the hard way. All right. If you can get him to bring up that shield again, I've got an idea. Enemies incoming. This should slow them down. Come on. Die. Well, that's intense. <laughs> oh, Garrus, you're fine. Shit. Oh, you took a bad hit. Whoa. It's quick. Shadow Broker, this is Operative Morat. We've had a momentary connection failure. Can you confirm stats? Mm. Operative Shora requesting update. Are we still online? Shadow Broker, I've lost our feed. We're online and awaiting instructions. Okay. What are you doing there, right? What are you doing? This is the Shadow Broker. The situation is under control. What? We experienced a power fluctuation while upgrading hardware. It disrupted communications momentarily. However, we are now back online. Resume standard procedures. I want a status report on all operations within the next summer day. Oh, Shadow that's Broker awesome. Alright, let's go, Liara. Let's go. You. How? Well, everyone who's ever seen him in person is dead. So. You're the new Shadow Broker. It'll be nice to have access to information I can trust. Broker. I'm not sure I'm ready for you to call me that. <laughs> I'm not sure about any of this, but I had to do it. Yeah. With the Shadow Brokers Information Network, I can... I can give you... I can... I'll check the power systems. Uh-oh. I spent 
Two years mourning you and Farron. And now I've got you both back. I... Let's see what we've got. It's all because of no you, Liara. Safeguards or user restrictions. It's like he never anticipated anyone but himself being here. And it's all ours. What kind of information are we talking about? I'm not sure. I'll need to go through his files. Come back later and I'll try to have something useful for you. Okay. All I wanted was to rescue Farron, but is it wrong that part of me wants this? Nope. With the Shadow Brokers network, I can help you. Maybe I can turn this operation into something better. Don't be a stranger this time. Come by when you have a chance. The doors are always open. Thank you, Liara. Thank you, Shepard. For everything. Oh. <sighs> Liara, Liara. Thank you, Liara, for saving me. I'm just returning the favor. Oh, what a long ass mission this is. Oh. Whoa, there's a lot of credit. Nice. Is it Udina? If you did that, then hell yes. This bitch. <laughs> Serve you right, bitch. Yes. Keeper 20. Set it down. Wait, what happened? Did that keeper kill that Krogan? Huh. Okay. Matriarch Atheta. Ilium. Oh, that baton bartender. Who's that? Is that Liara? Is she her dad? Okay, I guess this is too much already. Next. <laughs> Tachanka. Or not Taurus, where are you? Oh, come on, that's brutal. That's unnecessary. Hello, Liara. How are you doing, Liara? I'm a bit overwhelmed, to be honest. The Shadow Broker had more resources than you can imagine. Here, come on over. He had top level access to the Turian and Asari governments. <laughs> and more than one Solarian Dalatros traded intel. And now it's ours. You're not gonna turn into a recluse with creepy information on everyone in the galaxy, are you? <laughs> I can understand the temptation. I've got all the secrets of the galaxy at my fingertips. Give me ten minutes and I could start a war. Damn. But I've got a purpose. Helping you stop the Reapers. That will keep me honest. <sighs> Good. You know, relatively speaking. <laughs> if you're in over your head, we could just crash this thing and walk away. That's just it. In a way, I feel like I belong here. Working on my own, I was always hunting for leads. With the Shadow Broker's resources, it's about organizing, cataloging. I've got everything, Shepard. This is a dream job. Although, the location could be better. You need to set out on Normandy, Nira. Have you, you found anything you? useful yet? The Shadow Broker knew about the Reapers. Perhaps that's why he offered to help prove Saren's guilt to the Council. He didn't want Saren to succeed. He knew you weren't lying about your visions of the Prothean Beacon. There's even some data on the Protheans. I think he knew what was coming and was looking for a way to survive. Is that why he's working with the Collectors? How do you know what the Shadow Broker was? I didn't. I had no idea what to expect when we finally found him. But I researched pre-spaceflight cultures during some of my Prothean studies. I, I knew a bit about the Yogg. There's more on the terminals if you want to look. They're a fascinating culture, and a terrifying one. How's Farron doing? As well as you'd expect, after two years of intermittent torture. You gonna be okay? I don't know. 
He wants to work, so I'm letting him help. Maybe it takes his mind off it. So, are you guys together? So, you and Farron? No. He's been through a traumatic ordeal. Mm. He's emotionally fragile and needs to heal. He's very grateful to me for saving him. But it would be irresponsible of me to take advantage of that. It was good talking with you, Liara. Let me know if you need anything. I think what I need right now is a friend. I can't leave for too long, but spending all my time on this ship. Maybe next time you come by, I could come up to the Normandy. Let's go now. That sounds great. Why don't you come up now? Okay, thanks. I'll be right there. Just give me a minute. That smile. I guess, I guess, she's always in love to Shepard. Yeah. Did you she's enjoy sweet. the tour? Yes, it's a beautiful ship, and I ran into Joker. He seemed happy to see me, although he did ask if I'd embraced eternity lately. <laughs> of course he did. Oh, Joker. I also spoke with Dr. Chakwas. I'm glad she's doing well. <laughs> I brought you something. It took some digging, but I recovered your tags. I knew it. That, that was my tag. Well, thank you. I thought I'd never see these again. They changed hands more than once. Do you remember Admiral Hackett? Of course I do. He gave them to me so I could return them to you. He sends his best and hopes you're okay. So how are you doing, Shepard? I mean, really. Not what you tell your squad to keep morale up. Well, I am frustrated. Honestly, I'm tired. Tired of dealing with Cerberus. Mm -hmm. Tired of the Council ignoring me. Yep. Tired of my closest friends not believing me. Yep. Yes, I heard about what Ashley said on Horizon. I'm sorry. But their short-sightedness doesn't diminish what you've accomplished. There wouldn't be a man, woman, or child left on Horizon if not for you. Yeah, you was a set-up damn elusive man. You know the worst part of it? Cerberus planted intel to lure the Collectors there. Horizon was bait. Those bastards. They'd have hit another world if we hadn't lured them there, but... Aren't you gonna tell me not to work with them? I gave them your body, remember? What should I say? And I trust you. You'll stick to your beliefs no matter what Cerberus wants. So tell me what you want. What are you fighting for? For us... For us all. I guess I'm fighting for us. All of us. Yes. That's a lot of responsibility. People are messy, awkward, sometimes selfish or cruel. <laughs> but they're trying. And I'm gonna make sure they have a chance. I hope the galaxy proves itself worthy of the effort you're putting into saving it. I hope. I should get back to my base. But thanks for inviting me up, Shepard. Oh. Thanks, Liara. Come back soon. <laughs> wow. The elusive man wishes to speak to you in the debriefing room, Commander. Later. Yes, <laughs> we're under a quick look at Shepard's messages. Oh, don't act like you don't. Is what I do. <laughs> well, I guess she's smart as her sister. Okay, Garrus, talk to me. Is it about Sidonis? Shepard, I'm glad you came by. I've got something. I may need your help. Mm -hmm. You remember Sidonis, the yep. one who betrayed my team? I found a lead on him. 
There's a specialist on the Citadel, name's Fade. He's an expert at helping people disappear. Sedonis was seen with him. What are you planning to do when you find him? You humans have a saying. An eye for an eye, a life for a life. He owes me ten lives, and I plan to collect. Whoa. He's off. You sure that's yes. how you want to play it? I'm sure. I don't need you to agree with me, but I'd like your help. Where do we find Fade? I've arranged a meeting. We'll meet him in a warehouse near the Neon Markets down on Zakara Ward. Thanks, Shepard. I appreciate you taking the time to help me. No problem, bro. You're my bro. Of course I'm going to help you. Okay. Tally and Samara. Okay, let's talk to Samara first while we're here. Shall we? I am glad you came. I must ask for your help. That is not easy for me. What can I do for you? It's all right. Just tell me what you need. When we met on Ilium, I told you about a very dangerous person I was pursuing. Using the information you obtained, I have located her. She's been going by the name Morinth. I would like to apprehend her before she disappears again. Didn't you say you'd pick up her trail after our mission? I know where she is, right now. In a month, she may be gone. This is the best opportunity I've ever had. How important is this? Killing her has been my focus for 400 years. Damn. It is the most important thing in my life, and the reason I became a Justicar. Hmm. Where is she? Omega, a nightclub called Afterlife, which seems a perfect place for her to hunt. Tell me about her. She is an Ardot Yakshi. It is a term from a dead Asari dialect. It means demon of the night winds, hmm. but that is mythology. She is simply a very dangerous that's woman. A, that's a cool name. Without mercy. You are, you are dangerous too. You're dangerous too. <laughs> As are you. But she is different. Morinth's oh, a rare genetic disorder. This game knows when she meets well, I'm going to say, man. No gentle melding of nerves. We need to stop her. We need to stop her. <laughs> Thank you, Commander. Again. There are no words to express what this means to me. There is one thing more. This creature, this monster. She is my daughter. What? You said this is genetic. How many children do you have? Three. And three Ardat Yakshi are in existence today. It is as it sounds. Marinth was always the wild one. She was happy and free, but selfish. I needed to know this a long time ago. I present no danger to anyone besides my own children. And this is not easy to speak of. Even 400 years after I learned it. My daughter's condition is my fault. And my redemption lies in killing her. Tess is true. Do not pity me. Simply understand my situation. Tell me more. How did all this happen? I spent my youth on the move, adventuring. I killed people, mated with them, or just danced the night away. I learned so much, experienced so much. And then my matron days came. I could finally sit back, bask, and enjoy my family. But in one moment, it was all taken away. Hmm. It sounds terrible. I sat in a med lab while a nearsighted doctor droned at me, and I learned that nothing was as I thought it would be. I gave up all that I possessed. I owe nothing, claim nothing. All my knowledge will die with me. Now my purpose is to destroy my own children. Okay. Okay. Those moments change you. And I've hundreds of years left to live with that. I say too much. Forgive me. Help me find my long lost daughter. And kill her. Yeah. Okay. Okay, Samara. We'll go find Morinth. That's not what I expected. That name, Adayashi. Well, that's a cool name. I think I'm going to Do you make a something? song of that. <laughs> Hello, Thane. Have a few minutes to talk? Certainly. 
You know, when I went looking for an assassin, I expected to get a badass. Yeah. You seem more like a monk. Yeah. <laughs> In my experience, those who are truly dangerous don't act like they are. The Hanar trained my body for this role since I was six years old. Six? Huh. The Hanar? Excessively polite, worship the Protheans? They don't seem the type who'd train assassins. Every species trains assassins. Fair Hanar enough. are only unusual in that they need other species to do the killing for them. They have a strong grip and natural toxins, but... Have you ever seen one move quickly outside of water? Or fire a gun? Strong grip. Oh, right. Zeitz already told me about that. Right. You've been killing since you were six? Of course not. I didn't make my first kill until I was twelve. They were training me. I was not to be used and thrown away. I was an investment. That sounds very casual. <laughs> you were a child, not an investment. I've given you the wrong idea. They valued me, yes, as a resource, but also as a person. They regretted their need for me. Hmm. Why did your parents agree to this? The agreement was made under the compact. It was an honor for our family. The compact? We live on the Hanar homeworld because they rescued us, some of us, from extinction. We owe them our lives. That is the compact. Why was your race going extinct? Overpopulation. Wow. That must sound trite to you. Humans developed mass effect drive before the problem became acute. Our homeworld, Rakana, had few resources. We hadn't even developed fusion power when the soil began to fail from overuse and pollution. The Hanar found us a century ago. They sent hundreds of ships, evacuated thousands of us. Billions more had to be left behind. What's the state of Rakana now? Do you read your philosophers? A man named Thomas Hobbes. When all the world is overcharged with inhabitants, then the last remedy of all is war, which provideth for every man by victory or death. As Rakana died around them, my people slaughtered each other for mouthfuls of water, crumbs of food. I see. So what, what are the terms? What exactly are the terms of the compact? There are many things the Hanar can't do, even with mechanical aid. They ask Drell to assist them. <laughs> well, yeah. Yeah, sounds like a savory to me. This can't be legal. They made your whole race into slaves. Don't insult me, Shepard. Okay. Anyone can refuse to serve. Oh, okay. you do. We owe our existence to the Hanar. We are proud to repay the debt. Just asking. <laughs> the Hanar sounds like a whim. Yeah. <laughs> the way you describe it, the Hanar sound like weaklings. Out here they are. But if you could see them in the encompassing, the oceans of Kaje, you would see them differently. A stream of silver in the dark, looping, diving. So fast the eye can't follow. Laughter like the squeals of a child fighting against the water. They fly mm. over the black of the sea dead like birds, plumed with the light of heaven. But you don't kill for the Hanar anymore. You're freelance. What changed? I was asleep for a long time, yes. I paid no attention to what my body was asked to do, but then. Laser dot trembles on the skull. One finger twitch. He dies. Then, the smell of spice on the spring wind. Sunset covered eyes defiant in the scope. The laser dances away. My apologies. Drell slip into memory so easily. Huh. Was that one of your assassinations? Uh, yes. Perhaps we can discuss it later. I've wasted too much of your time. Not at all, but okay. Let's talk later, thing. Okay, let's go meet Telly. Are you okay, Telly? Is there anything wrong? Shepard, I'm glad you came by. Yeah. I may need your help. I just received a message from the migrant fleet. The Admiralty Board has accused me of treason. Why? I'm scared, Shepard. Why? Is it because you're working with Cerberus? I'm not working with Cerberus. I'm working with you. And I got leave to serve on the Normandy again. Right. I have no idea what they're accusing me of. You'd think I would remember if I betrayed the fleet. Nobody who knows you could believe you'd betray your people, Tally. 
I don't know. They don't lay charges like this unless the evidence seems absolute. But thanks. I appreciate your faith in me, Shepard. What happens when a Quarian is accused of treason? There's a hearing, with members of the Admiralty Board acting as judges. My okay. father is an admiral on the board. He'll have to recuse himself from judgment. I can't even imagine what he's thinking right now. The <clears throat> punishment for treason is exile. If they convict me, I can never go back. Shit. So you have no idea why they're accusing you? None. The specifics of charges like this are rarely discussed on open channels. I see. I won't know any more until I get to the flotilla. What happens if you're convicted? Like I said, exile. The specifics are up to the judges. If it's deemed only a tragic mistake in judgment, the guilty party might receive a small ship and supplies. Not that it really matters. Either way, if I'm convicted, I'll never see the migrant fleet again. So, no prison? So no prison and no death penalty? Hmm. We don't have the spare resources for long-term incarceration. Monitored work detail is more effective. And we don't have enough people to afford executions. I An see. exile can still have children, and those children are welcomed back to the fleet. Whatever happens, Telly, I will be with you. So how does the trial work? How soon do we need to get you there? They'll wait a reasonable period of time for me to come and defend myself. Eventually, if I don't show up, they'll try me in absentia. As mm. for how it works, it's less formal than an Earth trial or something you'd see on the Citadel. We are a family. This is just the worst kind of family meeting. Okay. Okay, Telly. Okay. Let's go find the flotilla. I was going to book passage on another ship. I didn't think there would be time for you to help. Thank you, Shepard. I'll program the Normandy with the flotilla's current location. The admirals will be waiting for us. She's scared, guys. Poor thing. Hello again. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, please leave a comment down below. Like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. And I see you guys very soon.